بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد اي الاحباب may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all with guidance bless us with ikhlas with tabal ala sunnah to nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and forgive us of our many sins and shortcomings and as we're all aware of hypocrisy is a horrid disease and we should be fearful of being hypocrites as the salaf of this ummah were fearful even the sahaba to rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam radiyallahu ta'ala anhum ajma'in were fearful Umar bin al-Khattab radiyallahu ta'ala anhu was fearful when he became aware of the list that Hudayfa bin Yaman had of the, which listed the hypocrites. So he was fearful that he was on the list. And this is Amir al-Mu'mineen, Abi Hafs, Umar bin al-Khattab radiyallahu ta'ala anhu. What about us? Listen to this beautiful statement of one of our salaf, Imam al-Hassan al-Basri rahimahullah ta'ala when he said, if it were not for the munafiqun, meaning the hypocrites, you would feel all alone in the streets, meaning the streets would be empty. Ayul Ahbab, isn't that enough for us to reflect on our lives? Are we living sincere to Allah Azza wa Jal? Are we avoiding hypocrisy? Or is our life filled with with this disease and the traits of this disease and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us all and bless us with ikhlas with abad and bless us to come closer to him subhanahu wa ta'ala may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all with tawfiq to make true tawbah and come to him and be away from the tra traits of the hypocrites wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa